right everybody it is dinner time in trucker aj land so we're gonna get some stuff put together real quick we're just gonna i'm gonna end up making just some boneless pork chops with some ranch seasoning we're just gonna dump them into the crock to the uh, insta pot these are frozen so we're just gonna cook them like we did the last boneless ribs hit them with some adobo some garlic onion powder pepper this ain't got to be pretty you just trying to eat y'all we can clean all this up afterwards all right, let me put this down so I can get this ranch packet open. We're going to put some ranch seasoning on it. All right, we got all our seasoning in there. We're just going to flip everything over a little bit. Try to get some seasoning on the bottom of these things. Easier said than done, but you get the idea. And then like last time, we're going to put some beef or chicken broth, whatever kind of broth you can get your hands on. Put it in there. Ideally, you would want to break these up and have them defrosted so you can cook them for I'd say 25 30 minutes but I'm gonna cook mine for 45 minutes but when it hits that 10 minute timer I'm gonna crack this open and um, separate them a little bit more and restart the timer for 30 minutes We're going to take and put the lid on it. All right, we got it on. We set it for 10 minutes. I'm going to break it up when it goes off and then reset it for 35 minutes. All right, y'all, this looks delicious. Look at that. Pork chops falling apart. Probably should have got my plate ready, y'all. Hold on. Hey, what we got? Look at that. Look at this, y'all. I'm going to cut this with a plastic spoon. It's just going to fall apart. Look at it. Jesus, fall apart good, y'all. Mm. I was just thinking I could have got me some some my my beans out the cabinet or something. Could have took the label off of them and poke a hole on the top of the can and put it in the Insta Pot and see what happened. Heat up some beans or something to go with it. But I, I, can you eat a baked pork chop with a plastic spoon and cut it up? This is tender, juicy, lots of flavor. But with everything else that's in there, you really can't taste that um ranch. So I would just not use a ranch packet because you can't taste it in here. You can taste all the other seasonings; it tastes good. But 
the ranch in here is just a, a waste. I put garlic, onion, salt, pepper, and adobo. That's all I put in here. Just dump it in a pot, set it, and forget it. It's cheap. It's easy. Delicious. Hell, if you got time, do it before you stop, and it'll sit here and be waiting on you when you're done. It's in a pot. It, it's not like it's going to spill out the floor if it rolls over or something. It's not going to splash out the pot, so go ahead and have it ready for when you stop. All I did is play on YouTube and Facebook waiting on this to cook. Took me less than three minutes to throw it in the pot and hit start. Ain't no reason why we can't sit out here in the truck and eat and cook. If I had a microwave, I'd be doing a little bit more. But uh, this is in the works. I'm going to get me one next week probably. So y'all stay tuned. This is Chucker AJ for the little cooking video. Hope you like it because I like it and it's delicious. Thank y'all for watching.